Hey guys, <clears throat> Oscar here for Nana Crouch, and I'm a little bit early to our dot-com lunch meetup, but I wanted to talk to you about the importance of an email list. I know I mentioned this before, I have videos about this, I have blog posts about this, but here's the biggest mistake people make, and this is not just for me, this is standard internet business practice. I often hear this phrase or this sentiment in one way or another. Oh, that's, that's great, but I'm going to wait to add an email list to my website until later when I'm ready, when I have more people coming to my site, when I have more clients, when I have more readers. Let me tell you, that is, besides not having a website, that is probably the single biggest mistake you can make. Because, especially at the beginning, at the beginning, nobody's going to care about your website. It's going to be hard to get anybody to go to it. As you are a new, a new website, it's going to be hard to get people to go to your website, to care about what you have to say. Even if you put it in your business card or your letterhead, or maybe share it with your Facebook friends here and there, you think, well, I'm not really driving traffic to it. I'm not sending anybody to it. Well, that doesn't really matter. Some people are going to go to your website because for whatever reason, you're going to give it to them, you're going to post it in different places. Every opportunity that you have, every opportunity that somebody has to communicate with you and you don't have a communication channel, it's a lost opportunity for business. So when somebody comes to your website, one of the main things that you should have available is a way for them to follow up with you or for you to follow up with them. That means offering them something to download or something to subscribe to. And at the very basic, a way for them to put in their name and email for a newsletter. Even if you don't intend to send a newsletter right now, that's what you can do later when you have clients, when you have more clients or more readers. When somebody comes to your website, that may be the last time they come on their own accord. Maybe they come, they look around for a few seconds, maybe a minute, which you will be lucky. And after that, they're not gonna come back because you're not Facebook, you're not YouTube. You have to give them a reason to come back. And that reason is your email newsletter. That opportunity is what's gonna allow you to start growing your business from the beginning. That sign up box is gonna give your readers, if you don't have that opportunity, you are losing business. And you're losing, more important than business, you're losing the opportunity to establish a relationship with your customers, your potential readers, your prospects, your leads. So it is as important as having a website that you implement an email newsletter service on your website. If you've noticed, every website I built has that built in. It's not optional. So I recommend that you treat it just the same as I do. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.